It's not over. Not yet. You know, there's still time for you to become who you were supposed to be. Maybe you had a goal and it faded away because life got in the way. Maybe you had a dream or maybe you're in a situation now where you're ready to give up. There's still time and just know that if you give up right now, if you quit, if you say, this is it, I'm done, you're guaranteeing that you're not going to become that version of yourself. You can be anything and do anything you want in this world. You have to have unwavering self-confidence in your ability to do anything in this world, my friends. Anything. Once you have that self-confidence, you will work towards your goals. And yes, you're going to have some days where you don't want to work. Yes, you're going to have some hiccups. But chances are you're going to be much better off than you are now. Or maybe you have some really lofty goals, like really lofty, and you might not reach them, but you'll come close. And if you don't try, then you know you'll never get there. You know, the last thing you want to do is be really, really old, you know, and you're at the point where maybe you're using a cane and you're looking back on your life and you're thinking, man, what went wrong? Why, why didn't I, why didn't I do this? Why didn't I try? You know, I think I've mentioned this before, but it's a very common thing. And I'll, I'll mention it again. They say that when people are close to death, when they are very, very old, they ask these people, what would you do differently in your life if you had the chance? If you could go back in time to some point in your life, what would you do differently and many times the answer is not something that they would do differently instead it's the things that they didn't do it's the r word regrets you want to live your life with no regrets i had a friend who told me that once Long ago, he was from the internet, one of my internet friends on IRC, Internet Relay Chat, for those of you that know. Bitcoin guy. He mined it when it was pennies, I think, or dollars. And he told me one day, that's how he lives his life, with no regrets. Live your life with no regrets. He was right. You don't want to look back and have regrets. So start believing in yourself. Have that unshakable belief that you could do anything because you can. Right? You can still become that version of you that you've always wanted to be. If you want to go to college and get a degree, you absolutely can do that. I do not think that that is a lofty goal at all. That is very doable. 
and realistic. Plenty of people get degrees. You certainly can. If you want to get a degree in mathematics, you certainly can. Physics, whatever. If you want to be a programmer, you certainly can. I've, I've known people, friends I've had who have done these things, and I've, I've had students who have done these things, and I've seen them grow academically and professionally from the very bottom, from people who could barely solve equations to people who are engineers, to people who are doctors and they're performing surgeries. You can become anything you want in this world and you have to have that unshakable belief. So how do you have it? How do you believe in yourself? Because I know many people don't. And I think that's because, not because they're weak, but because of society, right? Society is hard and people tell us things and we let their views, we let society's views and other people's views dictate our lives. Do you realize that life is not fair? Not everyone starts in the same place. Some people just got started before you. Doesn't mean they're better. It doesn't mean they're smarter. If someone is getting better grades than you in a math class and you're failing, it doesn't mean they're better at math naturally. It just means that they know more math and they've learned more, but it says nothing about their raw talent. You see, there's plenty of people in the world who are extremely talented at many things and they don't use those talents. Some people might call that wasted talent. Maybe it's a choice, right? Not everyone chooses to do what they're good at. I've known people who are extremely good at mathematics who have chosen to do other things. People who have way more raw talent than I do and they've decided math is not for them. So you can make your own choice in this world and you'd be surprised how much raw talent you have at things. So believe that you can do anything and realize that, again, not everyone starts in the same place. Maybe you just got a late start, you know? So you have time. As long as you're alive, you have time, right? As long as you're breathing, you can make choices and you have time and you're able to get where you want to be. Check out my courses, mathsorcerer.com or in the description. Check out my books in the description. Key point, you still have time to become who you want to become and do what you want to do. Just believe in yourself. You would be surprised at the amount of potential that lives inside you. Stay strong, my friends.